of sanguine. How are you doing, guys? <laughs> <laughs> we're good, we're good. We're good. <laughs> so, when did you arrive? Um, oh, blind. Oh, God, um, about two o'clock today or something. Yeah, so, busy. Yeah, I've been busy just running around and obviously getting to know Nottingham and, um, uh, yeah, just setting up and doing sound check and stuff like that. So, yeah. So, I reviewed your uh, new album. Yeah. Black yeah, Sheep. Yeah. <laughs> and it's a blinder. Oh, oh, in, right. the, in the review, I said it would catapult you to another atmosphere, didn't I? <laughs> and it seems it's, yeah, it's done well, that. That's all it's helped, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Well, the album obviously helped you yeah, to be yeah. where you are sat here today yeah. with supporting Mushroom Head. Yeah. It's been insane, hasn't it? It's yeah. been like, it, it literally, like, they're, they're, from the week the album dropped, I think within, within like, eight hours, it sold out on, like, all the, the, like, digital platforms, yeah. it sold out in all physical platforms, so, like, yeah. our distributor just went, med, like, you know, ordered, like, another bulk lot and into yeah. all the different countries and shit, but it was, so we, well, we weren't expecting that response, at all, like, really, we weren't so, seeing this yeah, coming, insane. you know? Yeah. yeah, so that was, that's been, been awesome. Yeah. <laughs> and it is an awesome album. Cheers, man, cheers. Uh, Favourite tracks are obviously the tracks that you've released on uh, videos. Yeah, Pretty Girl. Pretty Girl, Pretty Girl. Pretty girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You recorded that out in Vegas, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. The, 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 the video, video. Yeah, yeah. 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 We went and did a road trip. We'd never been to Vegas before. And yeah. originally we thought, oh, we'll, we'll probably shoot the video in Ibiza or something. Because yeah. we're going out there quite a lot to do all the you know, festivals and stuff over there. Yeah. Um, but we went over there and we were like, do you know what? This isn't quite insane enough. It's we not, needed more lights. Yeah. So um, we left it for a while and we thought, oh, we'll come back to it, come back to it. And then someone said, oh, let's do a road trip to Vegas. <laughs> <laughs> so, so all we, the band just jumped into yeah, the Yeah, pretty yeah, much. Yeah, yeah. Well, we yeah. had other things to do in LA. Yeah. So we, we, yeah, we, we got to LA and we drove from LA to Vegas, um, did Route 66 and all yeah. that lot. So, yeah. We did it in a Mustang, it was so cheesy. Like, we were like proper, like, you know. <laughs> Tourists. Like, yeah, tourists, you know what I mean? Just yeah. like, that's it. But it was good fun, man. Yeah, just literally hit, hit Vegas on a Friday night, and uh, we hadn't really thought about that. But we hit like literally peak time on a Friday night. It was just there's like seven lanes of traffic and just police everywhere. We we're like, shit, it's yeah, pretty, so pretty you, heavy there. So like. did you record the video yourself, or did you have a guy with you that was, it was uh, pretty like, much purposely there to do that? No, we did it pretty much ourselves yeah, in an yeah. in-house kind of thing. So um, that's why there's all single shots of the band yeah, throughout. Yeah. Yeah. So we're, we're standing behind the camera and Pass we're the camera. Turns, so, what, you yeah. using your phones or? No, 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 no like proper a, camera. <laughs> 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 just get some qualities. It's not like a yeah. or yeah. 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 something. Four <laughs> <laughs> case the whole time. Yeah. 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 A few yeah. slow moves in there. <laughs> <laughs> It was just like, I can't even remember what we shot it on, was it a 60 or something a like that? Yeah, it was, like, you know, you know, but um, yeah, it was, it was awesome. It, it went, helps to um, give you a different sort of, because you're primarily a metal band, aren't you? Yeah, yeah. You yeah, know, an yeah, operatic yeah, metal band. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And for you to be filming in Vegas, it sort of takes, separates you from the rest yeah, of it. It's not just someone in their dirty basement. Yeah, 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 yeah that's what it's called. We want to be a reflection yeah. of what we are, yeah. Like, yeah. We, we, we love colourful things, yeah. and we're really into like graffiti art, and... Yeah. You know that LA vibe. You know we we are attracted to that. We are a dark metal band, but that's why we're called Sanguine yeah. because we're actually quite an optimistic <laughs> band. Do you know what I mean? Like we're like a you know both ends of the seesaw, really. You know. Don't so, take ourselves too seriously. No. Right? You know, it's, it's no. more about the, about the fun of it. You know, so we have a, we have a good we're like. We were mates, I'd say, before we were a band, like, and then we sort of, you know, yeah. look out. You've been around a while, yeah, 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 that's it, that's it. Yeah, I'm yeah, yeah. saying to you guys, I mean, I met you guys first ever, being a Yeah, that's yeah. it, that's yeah. sweaty yeah. room. That's yeah. right. Yeah. 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 Was it the first, what was the first festival you ever did? Oh, the first one, yeah. Play that. Do you know what, oh, man, that was, I remember that, no, it was, it was a place called Castle, Castle Rock. Rock. And we were on yeah. it, like, oh. real <laughs> stupid time of it, it was like really, early. It was, I think it was like something like 9am, it was like, ew. It's going to be a festival at 9 a.m. And so we were like, what can we do to get everyone's attention? So we, so we literally went on pretty much naked, but we were covered in red body paint. I like, fucking literally head to toe in the ears everywhere. And literally, like, it caused, it caused like, a bit of a sensation. And then the, the, the BBC came down and started filming it. And it just, and it just went on. It just, like, it escalated to the point where we, we became the dominant band. Like, but we were the first one on. So, like, it kind of was like a reverse headline. Like, <laughs> it was really weird. Like, yeah, we had we we the whole like, day just trying to be like, yeah, it was, so, yeah. It was, 
there, there was people starting to, starting to like read themselves up as well, like, to, like as the day was, you know, went, went on. So do you think that's what attracted like people to come and see your shows? Or? Yeah, we've always yeah, been yeah. really insane, like, yeah, do you know what I mean? Like, we're all about stuff, yeah. the energy and getting crowd involved yeah like we're not really about that band that just play back-to-back -back songs and do not speak to the audience at yeah. all you know we're more about talking to the audience and trying to get them involved it's so. just, just having a bit of fun as it made i think yeah. that comes across it if like if you're having fun it sort of just rubs off and it's like yeah. pages, you know so it's just um, that's normally the, the, the thing on my mind like, it's just, well it's i recall you being one of the best bands of the uh, festival at being together Cheers. even though that was like a strange festival but yeah. it's <laughs> got, they've got they've found yeah. a new venue and i think you guys should go back yeah yeah what's well, so, it like, actually Jim, Jim like, you know what Bill 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 is on, is, he, he did yeah. a voiceover yeah. on our first our first album and we, we, we used it on like so on our, our, our first like, yeah, like we, demo we sampled release. the Bill radio Bill show, radio he, show. He, yeah, yeah. Um, you know played one of our songs and we said we sample this you yeah. love it and yeah. we actually put it on the you know introducing that track on the yeah. actual album fantastic so, so yeah. Yeah, it's cool. talking about albums going back to Black Sheep um, you say you've got a lot of connections with LA yeah. Did you do any of the recording, writing out there, or did you? Where did no, you our out video there? producer who did the Save Me video and Empty, he's over there. So obviously, um, Tyson Wade Johnson, he's um, he's been over at LA Film School, you know, doing his stuff over there, and he's mm. now been signed into some major LA. Warner Brothers, man. Where, yeah, where, where uh, yeah, yeah. So some TV series that he's going to do. So yeah. yeah, he gave us all that that support. Yeah. for those videos so that was kind of like we went and meet and greet him over there and also we're sponsored by Alpine Stars so we went over and met our sponsors over there and everything so you yeah. played shows out there? Yeah, yeah we played yeah. show out there um, on Hollywood Boulevard oh and, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah that was when we got signed for the first time actually like we literally played we played the Global Rock Summit and like and um, we picked up a record deal for um, was it Japan, didn't we? From yeah. there. And then that sparked a whole bunch of. It was really weird because like previous to that, we had no link to Los Angeles at all, like nothing. And then all of a sudden, everything became LA. Like we were there, and there was all these different people wanting to meet, and so we were out there, and it just. But there was no real reason for it, was it? Just kind of like we, you know, we're from Devon, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We were like, why are we, why are we suddenly in LA like, all the time? And like, yeah. you know, it was. And it just kind of escalated, that's why it's word spread. Part know? of being the band is about the adventure, and that's yeah, what we want yeah. to do. Do you know what I mean? We want to go to different places. Like, hopefully, like after we've done this UK tour with Mushroom Head, we're going out to Europe, and yeah. then after that, Japan. So, yeah. you know. Is that the second time out in Japan? That's, no, no that's this is the, the first, first time, time out. Yeah, yeah so yeah. it's been delayed a bit, but um, yeah, so we really want to go to all these different places, yeah. you know, and start growing. So, <laughs> how did you get on the tour of Mushroom Head? Um, oh, that was, that was for, um, blimey, that was for. A, Publisher actually, it was um, like we got we picked up a deal um, just after Christmas. We got we got a publishing deal, um, and then that kind of um, I think that that camp was was already talking to Mushroom Head camp yeah. sort of anyway. And well, so we, already, we, got, we said you know, to them like you know we'd love to do this tour. Yeah, yeah, we and, uh, they put in a good word, and yeah. we landed it. Thank it. God. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah really, just, really good. We just said yeah, we'd love to do it, yeah. and um, we're just thankful that they considered us. I've yeah. seen your pictures, a few pictures of. Like the venues are selling out. I mean, it's been a long yeah, time since yeah. Mushroom Head were last year, so yeah, yeah. there's going to be a big pull for them guys. Yeah, yeah, and obviously, yeah, yeah. a lot of people yeah, are going to see you. Yeah, we've been yeah. talking to all the fans as they're coming through the door, yeah, and they've been saying, Oh, we haven't seen Mushroom Head for the last 10 years, you know? Yeah, like, yeah. So they're uber excited and, you know, really dedicated fan base, and that's lovely to see. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah I, what I love about Mushroom Head is that they're very, yeah. and that's, I think that's how we fit in. Do you yeah. know what I mean? We're quite varied in that sense as well. Yeah. Your voice is, for saying you're quite a petite person, I can't, I can't believe what comes out of your mouth. It's just unbelievable. The first time, I was very close to the first time when like, we were the, the band ever heard that, it fucking just went silent in the room. Everyone was like, You're in. But yeah, it was like, it was like, we, like, we were like, you know, she, like, she was already a like, well impressive singer, and we, we, were, we, we knew that. And then one day, like, we were like, oh, can you, should, should we give, give a scream thing a go? And it, that came out. It's literally in the second. It was like, whoa, shit, we've got to use that. So, so did yeah. you have to audition for these guys? Uh, no, 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 it's not bad. I thought this was rough. Yeah, I actually placed a phone call and said I'm setting up this project because I went to Exeter University and that's how I advertised and I, I thought we'll, we'll start this project and it started off very singy um, and obviously um, as it went on we got heavier and heavier and heavier because that's what we had in common as musicians, we were all really really into our heavy stuff but you know we loved the singing part as well so when the boys were getting heavier and heavier and heavier they were like, do you have a hand scream? Like, <laughs> I was 
like, I don't know, I'll, I'll give it a go. And that's what came up. So did you, did you train classically then as a I singer? I didn't train, I've never had any training. I just always loved singing, even when I was a kid really. But um, yeah, I always fell into rock and punk and metal as I was growing up. Who did you up. listen to growing up then? Oh, everything. No effects, um, Nirvana, Metallica, uh, Soundgarden, that kind of stuff. And then, then I got into Korn and... Machine Head, Sabotage, Faith Lubble. Well, what's beautiful about your music is it doesn't sound like anything else. Oh, cheers, man. It's, you are too. quite unique, obviously, with your wonderful yeah. voice and your energy on stage. Yeah. I remember yeah. your energy and your guitar playing. <laughs> yeah, and his voice. And his voice as well. Did you back in single? That's part so, of the reason I picked up the phone because um, I met Nick back in college and then I moved away to Exeter. And when I was setting up this project, I, I was thinking, right, I really want something different as well. So. Having Nick, like he's a frontman in his own bands and everything, so um, I wanted his voice as well. So that's been really cheeky. But I, I love that mix of having lots of different vocals on albums as well. I don't, you know, I don't want too many, but like at the same time, I, I'm, I, I really love to do collaborations and stuff like that. I think I remember saying on the album review, you know, your voice complements your voice very well. Yeah. You know, where you're quite high, you're quite deep. Yeah. 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 There's, there's that nice balance there. Yeah, it yeah, does. Yeah, it yeah. breaks up the ears as yeah, well, doesn't exactly. it? Because if you just had my voice it might be a bit just piercing up here, you know, like I think that's the first track on the album. Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, you had to open it. <laughs> <laughs> it the window shut yeah. the <laughs> But it is a great opening track. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, yeah, and it yeah. sort of punches you in the face and says you've got to listen to the rest of this. That's kind of that's kind of sometimes, you know. There's, you know, sometimes we're sort of, you know, we're kind of aware of that, you know, when we sort of come in with that and we're like, this, this, this new something that's going to really go out and make people go, well, all right, what's, what's this? And, and kind of make them curious and then hopefully they explore the other stuff as well, do you know what I mean? Yeah. So, so, do you know that mix then between you two? Is it is it a collaboration as far as your writing? Yeah. 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 We're both, yeah. both yeah. songwriters in our own right, so, you know, I, I was the main driver behind songs like Pretty Girl and... Yeah. Uh, Mm. It's now a cool yeah. nasty girl. Yeah. 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 And then Nick brings in whole songs himself, and then we collaborate on other songs together where they're completely half and half. So, yeah, it can be a mixture of him bringing the riff and I do the vocals, or I'll sing the riff at him, and, and then he's already got vocal lines. So. There's a real natural balance, actually, because, like, you know, normally at the end of a, like a, a big sort of, you know, I'm trying to choose songs for the, for the album, like, um, we just sort of realised that the natural the natural ones we picked are about half and half, aren't they? Just generally, but, but yeah. we, we don't ever think about who's written no, what. It's, it's well, whatever's it's the, the best. best song. Like, but it kind of works out sort of yeah. naturally about fifty thirty. So black sheep's yeah. dropped. Yeah, it seems to be doing very well. Yeah, which is fantastic, yeah. and I know it would yeah. do. Are you the type of band that continuously write, or are you, are you the sort of people that write a band, tour the hell out of it, and we, say, actually we need to write a new band? Uh, both, no, no, no. both of us. I mean, we, we constantly write, don't we? I mean, it's like it's well, not a yeah. We've got like fifty no songs already waiting really? to be yeah, recorded. Yeah, I yeah, mean, yeah. our back catalogue just keeps going because yeah. we. That's what we mean. Nick love doing. We love writing songs, mm. and you know we've got so many songs for other projects as well that eventually we'd love to do. But at the moment, we're going to put all our efforts into Sanguine. Yeah, that's yeah. that's what we want to do. So, uh, hopefully, fingers crossed, we'll be able to get the second album and just you know. Hopefully, uh, yeah. well, you're signed to a record. Yeah, we've, um, we've 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 got a few sort of like we've um we've got a few. It's, it's quite a new model actually we're working here, isn't yeah, it? Like, yeah, yeah. Like we, we, we've got a very, very different road to other bands. Yeah. yeah. So so we're still indie, so we've still got full artistic control, which is the most important thing to us. Because when you get labels involved, sometimes they're a little bit like, yeah, yeah, we love it, but yeah, could you wear something yeah. different? Or could you yeah. be something different? And you're like, well, I you don't understand that. You have to kind of prove you know? what your product is. You got, first, you got, you know? Especially if you're breaking a yeah. few boundaries, you have to go out and you know say, yeah, this is what I want to do. So, um, you're quite stubborn, aren't you? Really? Yeah, you yeah. Be a bit like, so it's know. a mixture of different labels and different partners. Mm -hmm. And I know it's probably too early to ask, but mm -hmm. have you got? You've obviously if you've got fifty tracks in the pipeline. Mm -hmm. Are you looking to release another album again soon? Yeah, yeah, we're starting to get back um, in the studio. Yeah, yeah. A <laughs> the touring and everything yeah. else we've been setting up. So you yeah. must have a lot of offers to play festivals this summer. Yeah, yeah. So you can just mention now. Well, we're hoping to go over to Europe. So yeah, yeah. we've got we've, we've got a few things that are so exciting that like, in the but, but we can't we, we can't mention them yet. But we've got <laughs> we've just like, we've, we've just been working with, with like um, um, a really big scale. Um, a producer as well. He's, he's um, like we we can't mention who it is yet, but yeah. he's there's always like, something like, like, so like, we'll yeah, have something so, coming out soon. Yeah. Just watch this space. So it's, yeah. <laughs> okay, well, it's been an absolute pleasure talking to you. You okay. too, man. I look forward to seeing you on stage. I, I <laughs> yeah, 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 no, not yeah, at all. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, 
I just support good music. Yeah. <laughs> you produce good music. <laughs> like that. <laughs> Thank you very much for talking to me. Take care, man. I'll be your